I'm recording my podcast on the day of our Great British Comic Relief Bake Off, and I thought I'd send, and that's why I'm in my jumper, and I thought I'd give you some messages just about what's coming up in the term ahead at our lovely academy. First of all, thank you so much for all of your feedback that you that you that you give us. It's it is very very good. Remember though, if something's not right. And, you know, we try our best to get things right, but sometimes that's not always the case. Please, don't worry. Don't bottle it up. Life's too short. Come and see me. Um, make appointment to see me. I'm always around, and together we'll do our best to sort it out. I'm in the middle of appraisal at the moment. I've been watching every teacher in the school um, teach. I, I do that relentlessly throughout the year. And uh, I'm pleased to say that the, the majority of the learning in our school is outstanding. And, and that's really nice. Almost a year to the day of our last Ofsted inspection. So what's coming up next term? Well, there's chickens. There's chickens galore. They're very excited. There's chickens galore, and I'm um, and I'm excited about that too. Um, in line with the general election, we're going to have our own head teacher election. There's going to be different parties, probably a pink party, a purple party. The children decide their own colours, canvas, make a podcast, and then we have a big election. My teachers are making their own podcast for you, and they're trying to capture top tips for schooling, things that you can do at home just to advance your child and that will sit alongside on our website alongside our top tips for maths and our top tips for writing so please have a look at them and if you have any questions do come back and um, finally I just need to say um, please do come to the Easter Bonnet Parade it's my favourite one of my favourite days of the school year and um, I hopefully I'll see you there our children work very, very hard during the school holiday, um, during school time. We do our very best to make our children exceptionally well prepared for the next stage in their learning. But at holiday time, they need to rest, chill, and have some good connections with their families. Oh, but still keep up the reading. Children need to read every day. Have a lovely Easter break, and I'll see you in the summer term.